this is Petit Petit for Android. We are a smart home screen uh, replacement. So if you press your home screen button, you get um, uh, the menu here. You can choose between the standard um, home screen and Petit Petit. Uh, this is Petit Petit. A standard home screen would show you your applications as we see it here. Uh, but we are focusing on your personal data um, and we are constantly analyzing and categorizing it. So what you see is your people, your things, your places and your times that you spent. And we have a little paradigm here so you can scroll through your uh, contacts. Let's say I have 700 contacts, right? And I now want to know who's working at XB. So what I can do is I can take this icon uh, up here and I filter my contacts uh, basically to those six that are uh, working at that company. Um, when you want to call somebody or uh, do something, you get an action bar by just tapping him. Uh, you can write a message, call him and so on. Um, but you can also drag him out from that list and use him uh, for the retrieval on the timeline, which is the rightmost screen, uh, so that you see all of the um, different data that you have, um, like emails, but also short messages, call logs, uh, tweets, and so forth, uh, so that you immediately get not only your email, uh, emails, but really the look at this guy uh, ordered by time. <laughs> thing is um, you can look at your emails um, and filter them again using this halo area here by just taking uh, one of these um, uh, let's say senders up here and then you filter your data according uh, to that second sender uh, where you shared your data very easy uh, email retrieval okay so when I go back to my um, screen here, I can write a message to Constantine by tapping him and saying uh, pity pity messenger for writing tweets, emails, whatever. So I'll write an email to his um, address here. And what you see down here, that's our copilot. The copilot is constantly analyzing what you're doing. Uh, also in your productive uh, applications. So when I uh, tap my people here, I get the related people that I work with uh, constantly with Konstantin. I just take Nicola, for example, and can add him uh, to the recipients. Very easy. And when I write uh, my message here, I could uh, have something like, um, I read, um, article about Nokia um, and what I get here is my places which is also my stored uh, websites I can for example look at uh, the Wikipedia article about Nokia and um, then I can take that out and add that uh, to my email and send that right away so what I have consumed in the past uh, can get productive uh, in the future, right? So that's a very easy way um, to be productive with um, uh, Petit Petit. Uh, what I can now do is I can look at uh, different, let's say, companies. So that I'm uh, filtering my contacts here to companies. Um, I take out, let's say, Microsoft. Uh, so now I have these two companies here, I can multi-touch them and this is Magneto. It's a retrieval uh, mechanism that is showing you things that these two concepts have in common in the middle. Uh, on the left you see uh, what's exclusive to Nokia and on the right you see what's exclusive to Microsoft. And we are doing some linguistic voodoo here and you see, okay, a uh, common enemy is Apple, for example. Uh, Migo is still alive after the uh, merger and Steve Allop um, came from Microsoft and now is working uh, at Nokia. You see that uh, they are concerned or have been concerned with uh, Symbian. They have uh, Nokia Siemens networks. Um, 
they had OV is a Finnish company and so on. Uh, so I can now touch uh, Symbian and then I get all of my related knowledge um, about Symbian here. For example, uh, the stored articles that I had um, in my uh, browser and I can look at that article again in my PTPT browser. Um, and the nice thing is we have the Copilot here again. So that's a very easy way to uh, look at what you know while you're consuming some of the data. Um, yeah, download Petit Petit for Android on petitpetit.de. Thanks.